You need an electronic archive with documents stored in a searchable format, but you don't have time for manual sorting and conversion of scans? Abbey Flexi Capture is usually used to capture data from scanned documents. However, it can be also tuned to recognize, classify, sort and save scanned documents in searchable format without human participation. So, once paper documents are received, you proceed with its scanning. Scanned images are saved in a folder, so-called hot folder. It's a regular folder, but it is monitored by Flexi Capture. Flexi Capture imports images and recognizes them. Then, type of each document is automatically identified and it is saved in a searchable PDF format in appropriate folder. In such workflow, human is involved in scanning process only. The rest is done by Abbey Flexi Capture in completely unattended mode. What is even more important, configuration of such workflow in Abbey Flexi Capture is not very complicated and rather quick. So let's look how it can be done. Here we have several invoices from three different suppliers. First, uh, we will have to create a classifier in order to help Abbey Flexi Capture to distinguish one supplier's invoice from another. Classifiers are created in Abbey Flexi Layout Studio, which is a part of Abbey Flexi Capture. I create new classifier project. And load several images of my invoices. The next step is to recognize these invoices. There is no need to dive into in-depth study of the application. Flexi Layout Studio may analyze uh, documents and create and train classes automatically. Let's see how it works. At this point, Flexi Layout Studio analyzed all our documents, tried to find uh, similar and uh, created class for each group of similar documents. So as you may see, we have uh, three groups and this is correct because we have invoices from three different suppliers. Let's give more self-explanatory names to our classes. Now let's train parameters of our newly created classes. To do this, it is necessary to choose images for training. Let's use them all. And launch training. Training is finished and now let's check our classifier. All documents were successfully classified and we are ready to export our classifier project. To process our invoices, we will need three document definitions in Abbey Flexi Capture, one for each supplier. Document definitions should be based on flexible layouts. But actually, since we just have created a classifier to distinguish our documents, all we need just three empty layouts. They are also created in Flexi Layout Studio, but it is necessary to use Create Flexi Layout project in this case. And again, I need to load some images. and pre-recognize them. To exclude processing of documents, which might be by mistake scanned together with the invoices, we may create one element of uh, static text type to tell the program that uh, this layout should be applied to the document with the invoice title only.
static text element was successfully created and now let's launch a test uh, to check that keyword invoice is found on all of our invoices. So test finished and uh, here is our keyword. So as you may see it worked uh, in all of our images. The layout is ready and can be exported for further work with document definitions. We will export three times one and the same layout with different names corresponding to each supplier because actually classifier is responsible for document distinguishing. So our first class name was Eat My Snacks Invoices. I name layout like that and export it. And I do exactly the same thing for two other layouts. Now we have everything ready to configure a project in Abi Flexi Capture. Now let's create a new project and configure hot folder which will be monitored by Abi Flexi Capture. Now let's create document definition for the invoices from the first supplier using relevant layout. We are not going to capture any data from our invoices, all we need just to export them in appropriate folders. So all we have to do in document definition editor, just to set up or export destination for the images. For two other suppliers I am simply duplicating existing document definition, renaming it and changing the layout. document definitions are ready and the last thing we have to do is to load classifier. Our project is ready for processing of the invoices. Here we have 45 invoices, let's copy them into hot folder and see how Abiflexi Capture will absolutely automatically process them.
import again now that's time for recognition and Abi Flexi Capture already started to export recognized invoices. We may see it in this folder. Finally, all our invoices were successfully recognized, classified and exported to appropriate subfolders. So as you may see, now we have three subfolders which corresponds to one of the suppliers. And here we have relevant invoices. For instance, this is Juicy Drinks Limited. Let's check another folder. Here we should have eat my snacks. Yeah, that's correct. And also, what is important, invoices are saved in searchable PDF format. So even if you forget where you saved your invoice, you can easily find it remembering some text written inside. For instance, invoice number. Here it is. That's how Abiflexi Capture can automate creation of searchable archive and enable you to focus on the core activity of your business. Free trials of Abi Flexi Capture can be requested at www.flexicapture.com. Thank you very much for your attention, and if you have enjoyed this screencast, please like our Facebook page, which is available at www.fb.com/abi3a.